So welcome, YouTube, to a new episode of Fallout 4. I gotta cover some stuff before we actually get started with this. Um, first thing, I spent a lot of time off cam going around and waiting for random encounters, and I managed to get every level 4 vendor that I wanted, which is the weapons guy, the armor guy, and also, I mean, I ended up getting the doctor. I didn't really care about her, but I got her anyway. Um... And then I get, I have the Vault Tech rep, but he doesn't count because you're giving him. Um, but yeah, you know, I don't have, like, the, the food store, the, the clothing store, or anything like that. I don't even know if they exist, but, like, I don't even have tier 3s built, and I don't care to build them, so I did that. Um, this guy's inventory is honestly not what I was hoping for. He has a lot of money. The reason he has none is because I sold that um, Gatling laser for, like, 1,800 caps. Yeah, like, he's got a lot of ammo. Like, he's a really good gun guy, but he's really bad for melee. I was hoping, I mean, I kind of expected that, but I was hoping he'd be kind of okay. You know, I was hoping he'd have, like, a few things, but, like, you saw at the top, he had, like, a vanilla boxing glove, a vanilla bat, you know, no mods at all. What I was really hoping for, something, you know, big. What is this? Oh, that's what, I, yeah, that's what I sold. He wants 6,500 caps for it. Damn, what a scam. I sold it to him for like 1700 and he sells the Reckoning, which is pretty good, but I don't really want it. I, I mean, I guess it, like, it is kind of a unique weapon. I have been wanting a unique weapon, but... Yeah, let's see, like, he did, like that's it. It's, it's weird that he has a unique legendary weapon, but does not... Or, unique legendary melee weapon, but doesn't sell melee weapons. And then I've got, I think actually Nick might be carrying it. This pen- yeah, this right here. A penetrating super sledge. This was huge when I got it, but honestly, like, I've been thinking about the math, and I don't think it's actually gonna be that good. Um, really, really high base damage, and ignores, you know, a lot of damage and energy resistance, but it requires, like, I think it's rank 3 gun nut to actually put on that second part that makes it- that gives it the energy damage. Um, and then I think the energy damage is unaffected by the big leagues perk, or maybe it just is and it's really low. Um, but then more importantly, the thing about this bat, it's, god, it's annoying how, like, good a guaranteed legendary is. Um, it, it, you know, has way, it has, like, a huge cost reduction in vats, you know, like, look how many hits I can get off, you know? Who's gonna survive that? Each one's doing over 100 damage. So, yeah, um, I'm still kind of I'm still kind of using this bat. I'm gonna carry the super sledge around on Nick in hopes of finding the mod, maybe, and then I won't have to get rank three uh, gun nut. And then I also did I started Far Harbor. I didn't actually start it. I listened to the radio station and I like I did a whole recording segment on this. I listened to the radio station. I went and talked to Ellie. Did all this, but then I ended up deleting it accidentally because I deleted a bunch of other stuff at the same time and I forgot that I actually needed that file and so now it's gone forever. Um, but yeah, like it was kind of, it was kind of nothing anyway. So yeah, that's, um, you're all caught up now. Uh, the armor guy doesn't have anything either. A doctor has nothing as expected, but whatever. Um, so yeah, I will, I will be back at the Nakano residence. Welcome back, YouTube. I'm not actually at the Nakano residence yet, but I've mentioned this before. I want to record stuff I've never done before, and I've, you know, this entire area is pretty new. I'm only, like, just out of the slog. But I need to unlock this workshop, and then I need to get people up here, because this will be my best, um, fast travel location. Damn, owned. Alright, I guess... Okay, we're done there. Um, yeah, this is an extremely weak workshop. Because, like, you can't, you can't do anything. The whole thing is taken up by trash. Um, you can get some wood out of it, I guess. Yeah, uh, the next time I'm in town, or the next time I'm, like, back in this area... Actually, mm, The slog isn't too far, and I have, I have generic settlers at the slog, so maybe I'll do that. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna pause the recording. There's actually a couple more things I want to do before I actually go to the Nakano residence. Just right here. Um, and then I will, I will be back. Here we are, YouTube. Back along the coast. 
Um, I set I set up a supply line. I made a bed and stuff there. That's good enough for now. I thought about setting up some corn to farm, but I don't really need that. I thought. Huh. I thought there was an ambush right here. Maybe there is. Because, oh yeah, actually it might be right here. I just want to like clear out this ambush. Maybe ah, I'm trying. Like I'm trying to think, how long is this video gonna be? And I think it's actually gonna be very long. Yeah, I thought there was supposed to be. Ooh, ooh, an albino. Weird. Man, look at this pack. To get the alpha owned. Damn, Nick. It's brutal. Now one more. Wow. Disappointing. Oh, here they are. No legendaries? Alright. Ooh, double. Ooh, double kill. Alright, not really what I was hoping for, but decent enough, I guess. Bunch of XP. And my provisioner's already in town. Um, one time, actually, I, did, like, I think this was before Far Harbor came out, I was up here, and there was actually a super mutant that spawned where those raiders were. And I spent, like, it was a legendary, and I was a low level, I spent, like, all day killing it. I threw like 30 Molotovs because that was the only thing I had that did damage because I, like, I was like level 6 or something. I spent all day trying to kill this one legendary. And it drops, it drops something really trash like like one of those legendaries it does more damage if you're addicted to ev everything. It was something really really trash. And I, you know, and I wasted all my damage on it. The Connor Residence is kind of weird, because I guess you're supposed to come around like this, but I didn't even know this whole, like, path existed until, like, the third time I did this. And now, actually, it's been quite a while since I did Far Harbor, but on my last playthrough, it was a survival playthrough, but it was rifles. Um, I did learn about the solar-powered perk. And so hopefully I'll be able to explore Damn it. quite a bit. Come in! I know you're listening on the other end. Where is she? Where is my daughter? I uh, hope you don't mind. We let ourselves in. Nick, thank God. You need to get to work right away. She could be hurt. She could be... Whoa, whoa, slow down. Uh, Kenji, was it? Why did you go over the details with me and my partner here? You brought a partner? Good. The more eyes, the better. So, what's the story with you and Nick? Nick didn't tell you? Ran with him on one of his cases a few years back, searching for some sort of lost heirloom. He needed a boat. Things didn't end well. We were double-crossed by the client once we had what he was looking for. I still have some lead lodged into my hip. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, it's starting to come back to me. Sorry, things ended sour. We got out. That's all that mattered. And now you can return the favor by finding my daughter. We're here to help. Tell us what happened. It's all thanks to this damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. The radio was her latest project. Until she made contact with some kidnapper who lured her away from us. Or maybe she left on her own. She's not a child anymore. Our daughter is 19. She knows how to survive, and she's capable. I... think maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No. She would have told us where she was going. She would have said something. I know my daughter is in danger. I can feel it. Find her, please. 
I could ask for money, but the amount of stuff you get out of this DLC, I think, uh, I don't think I need to do, do you that. Have any idea where she could have gone? We know she took one of the boats, but that's all. She could be anywhere. We'll find right, her. Thanks. Don't you thanks worry. Thanks for that lead. Thank you. Her room is upstairs, if that helps. And uh -huh. don't worry, Kenji. We'll get to the right. Man, he's just like, she took a, she took a boat. She could be literally anywhere on the entire globe. It's like, oh damn, thanks for that. Looks like this is Kasumi's room. Let's see if she left any clues about where she. I don't remember exactly what I'm looking for. I know there's like, uh, hmm, what is it called? Like a picture down at the docks. Like you open it and you talk to it or whatever. Ooh. Why is it so quiet? Okay. I could qu I don't know. Is it worth questioning them? That's the that's the poor man's way. Let's try to just skip a little bit ahead down to the dock. The answer is in the boathouse. And then picture where the key is. That's what that means. Um, it's like in yeah, right here. Good work. Now let's see what's in that safe. Project log. Um, myself. I never really thought about who or what I am. on that hollow tape. Daughter takes off by boat, but more importantly, there's a colony of synths up near this far harbor. We need a way to get there. Let's go talk to Kenji. He knows the waters better than anyone. Have you finished your investigation? Did you find anything? I found much. I think I know where Kasumi went. A place called Far Harbor? She went that far up north? God, that explains why she took the boat. There's no time to waste. You have to go after her. Wait, did you find out why she left, Detective? Who she was speaking to? What does it matter? Because I know my daughter, and if she didn't tell us where she went, then she had a reason. Don't you want to know if she wants to be found? <sighs> You're right, Detective. Did you find any clue to why Kasumi left home? Yeah. Your daughter made contact with a group of synths. She thinks she's one of them. What? That's... that's crazy. She's not a synth. She's our daughter. We raised her. I... I gave birth to her. She's flesh and blood, not a synthetic. Maybe your daughter is just confused. Having an identity crisis. Oh, God. 
Does she even think we're still her parents? Is she? I don't even know if she's a synth, honestly. Take my ship on the dock. It has a guidance. I feel like she's not. What if I just say no? That's crazy. I trust that boat with my life. My father worked on it every day until he died. And it is all I can offer. Let me know Sad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you could just say no and, like, just pause the DLC. Are you willing to take my boat now? Find my daughter? Oh, I guess. You're sarcastic. A boat ride. Uh, while I know the seas <laughs> aren't exactly... I know you have oh, my God. payment. And we can't offer much, but... Ooh, ooh. Hell yeah. No way. No way. I didn't even know that was a thing. Ooh, hello, cat. I don't have an offering for you. Or a gift. Destiny 2 memes. Um, what actually happens if I tell the railroad about this? Or the brotherhood. The bro I mean, I guess the brotherhood. Oh, wait. Is it a miscellaneous objective? Okay, it'll. so it won't go away then. Let's hit it. He Nick, are you on the boat? Oh, shit. Imagine if he didn't come. Like, imagine if there was a chance your companion just wouldn't come. Oh, God. Jumping is so buggy on this. Like, you're not supposed to, like, fall back like this. I guess, okay, I guess Nick's just not coming. I'm real. Why is my character so hungry? Damn. Built entirely on a coastal pier on the edge of the island. No, oh, I, I don't think I've ever like look, actually looked at this the way it used to say Bar Harbor, and they like just kind of scuffed over the B. Nick's still not here. You better show up. I mean to be mad. Also, I love how like there's this whole contraption here to automatically steer the boat for like no reason too. Like. I, like, I don't know, I don't know, do, do, do actual fishing boats have, like, auto-navigation systems? I don't really think they do. Especially not one like this. Where you just have this massive machine bolted onto the, onto the wheel. <laughs> Put the damn gun down. Fucking Flatlanders. Can I? Ooh, got all that XP. Oh, hey Nick. Finally decided to show up, huh? Are you lost? This is Far Harbor. We, uh, we don't get many visitors around Weapons here. Weapons are what's gonna win us back our island. We don't need okay. no freeloaders or more help, Mainlander. So you can get back in your boat and leave. Alan, this isn't your dock. It belongs to the whole town. And that means strangers are welcome. Uh, sorry, you've caught us during a, a difficult time. Uh, but Alan's got a point. Not all visitors have good intentions. So, uh, what's your business here? Look at for Kasumi. Woman from the Commonwealth named Kasumi may have passed through here. A family hired me to find her. Some sort of detective, huh? Well, she came through here all right. At least we know she made it this far. I love how she just goes straight to detective. Like Something's coming from afar. Like have you ever met a detective? In the town and I'll answer any questions you have. Take a post at the top of the wall near the main gate. The hall never lets us down. Now follow and I'm gonna I'm gonna eat a little bit. Follow me. Be careful on the hall, stranger. Don't man the hall. Something's out there. All right now. You sure hmm. I might actually. I don't know. I might um drop my settings a little bit for Far Harbor because the fog is kind of. It does kind of do it to you, you know. I don't know if I'll actually participate in this part, because <laughs> if I drop off, I'll probably die. Okay, you know what I'm going to do, actually? I'm going to do this, because if I don't, I'll have to redo the whole thing at the Nakano residence, and then come through the load screen on the boat again. Let's see what we got down there. There's a legendary already. Now we're talking. Damn. They're like full-grown gulpers, too, because I'm such a high level- Oh no, I'm in danger. 
I can't, like, I don't know if they have spit attacks, but I still can't really risk. Can I just open this? What would they, oh, requires key. What do we, what do we got down there? Is the legendary dead? Damn. I suppose you could get back up if you, like, went all the way around, hopped in the water, swam around. Oh, there's the legendary. Oh, Nick jumped off, because he's got a melee weapon. I hope we don't, like, lose this. Because if I have to drop down, I'll probably die. This young gulp. Nice. Nice throw. Man, they all have, like, assault rifles and stuff, because I'm... S I don't know. Are they scaling, too? I'm not actually sure. I think they are. This guy's losing against the Red Rooch. I actually have to be careful if I jump down, too, because I don't want to kill this guy with my massive area of effect. Because I'm so good at the game. Oh, jeez. Man, that legendary is just tanking this. Oh my god. Oh, look at them all. <laughs> oh shit. Do I still have that bottle cap mine? I do. Interesting. Kobe. Oh, this is fucking awesome. This ain't nothing. Oh man. Bottle cap mines are too good. I've never actually done an explosive build. It would be very difficult because there's just not enough grenades. But I really want to see like what a bottle cap mine can do. There's only one person left up here. It's over. No. Eyes on the fog. Something's Ooh. coming. I think a big boy might be coming. Oh no, legendary glowing. Oh jeez. Oh <laughs> jeez. Oh, man. Alright. Well, you know what? I've kind of... Uh, I was going to go down and sneak attack. But... I don't know if I can risk it now. Yeah, I feel like their, their spit might even get me. Honestly. That one angler is almost dead. But that legendary is still at full health, and then is going to regen its health. Maybe I'll just go for it. Oh, actually, never mind. My damage is so fat. I'm... <laughs> and then I just got weakness. Alright, where's the legendary? That's interesting. Nah, it doesn't really matter. Meat hook. I think gulper enter is actually really good, aren't they? Yeah, they are. And I'm pretty sure you cook them at a one-to-one -one ratio. Not that I need this stuff. Angler meat. That's also good, actually. I think cooked. Actually, what is... Oh, angler meat right there. Nice. Avery, and now you see what we're up against. I didn't realize my damage was going to be that good. It spits out have taken the whole island from my people. But for your help when we needed it, you deserve this. Mm, thank you. I did a lot. If you managed to survive despite all that, you must be tough. <laughs> Ornery, more like. I just... I'm done cowering behind your damn hull, Avery. It's time you let me deal with the real problem. With the right people and my guns, I can end those children of Adam cultists for good. The fog's been here forever. The children didn't make it. Before the rat eaters came, the fog was under control. They come, and it all goes wrong. It's time we do something. No need to burden a stranger with all this nonsense. Can we get back to business? Sorry for all that. You're here for Kasumi, right? She headed inland to the Synth Refuge, Acadia. Getting there will be dangerous. You'll need a guide. Old Longfellow. No one knows the fog like him. But uh, word of warning, he's a bit of an acquired taste. 
Thanks for the info. Best place to look for Longfellow's at the bar. Please, lend a hand around town if you're... And let me say something you might not hear again. Thank you. So, I really want to use Longfellow. I think he, he's a really cool companion to use for Far Harbor, but I want to use Nick because you get a lot of unique dialogue with it. You get, I mean, you get some, I mean, obviously, like, everything Longfellow says is unique to Far Harbor. But, like, Nick actually gets a lot of dialogue around the synths and everything. And I probably will be siding with the synths. The synths. Definitely not with the Children of Adam for, actually, I don't know. I remember siding, like, with the Children of Adam on my Rifles character. And I had a really good legendary, uh lever action rifle and then I couldn't use it anymore <laughs> because because nobody sold the ammo for it yeah. reduced fall damage hell yeah oh wait no damn what do you need to like cook gulper innards gulp oh yeah invisibility but I thought I think maybe I'm just thinking like gulper innards are really good by themselves Yeah, I think that's what I'm thinking, because... Let me look through. Yeah. They are pretty- like, they are pretty good by themselves. Let me bring them back up. Yes, I mean, 60 health, 2 rads. 2 rads is literally nothing, especially because they'll be gone in 2 seconds anyway. This thing is interesting, though. Trying to have a conversation here. Shut your mouths, open your damned ears. So the fogs are coming for us all, and I can't see any better way of greeting it than to have another round. On the house. Oh damn, on the house. Good yeah. deal. Time to I was thinking, is he really just gonna rile them all up to make him buy more drinks? Mainlander, today's your lucky day. Free beer mm. for you. What does he give you? Ice cold beer. Anything yeah, stronger? Anything a bit stronger. Pushing your luck, I mean, you? Christ, we're in Maine. You got any Allens or something? So, drink up. Vodka. Jeez. I mean, come on. You got a like you got a main this. character named Allen. You think you'd sell Allens? Maine memes. I'm actually from Maine, which is you know that so that makes me better than everybody else you've seen do this DLC. What did he? Yeah, he gave me. Vodka, get rid of that. What does the ice cold beer do? I don't like I don't know what normal beer does. So I don't know how to compare it. But it look it looks about the same as normal beer, and I don't like alcohol and fallout has always been kind of trash. Anyway, that's gonna be the end of this video, and I'll see you in the next one.